What's up everybody, it's Alex from ASUS, back again for another episode of Month in Review. And before we get started on today's segment, I would like to welcome everyone back from their vacations. I hope everybody enjoyed their holidays. Also, we do have three products we're going to be talking about today, but before we get into that, I would like to cover ASUS's appearance at the recent CES 2015, where we unveiled the new Zenfone 2 and the new Transformer Book Qi. Now keep your ears open because we will be releasing a lot of new information about these hot products following their eventual release this year, in 2015. Now the first of the three products today is the Sabertooth Z97 Mark S. The second one we're going to be talking about is the new RT AC3200 router. And lastly is the Strix GTX 960 graphics card. Let's take a look. So the first product today is a Sabertooth Z97 Mark S. Now I have to start out by telling you this is extremely limited edition. Very limited edition. It will sell out. Now, this has been long awaited by the fans and we do appreciate your patience for that. It comes with all the standard features, the great standard features, of the Sabertooth Z97 Mark I, but of course is boasting a drastically different appearance. This arctic camo clad board was sure to impress the most discerning PC modders. But we didn't stop there. If you lift up the white armor, laying underneath is a white PCB. So for all you wannabe interior designers out there, this is the board to get. The next product is the new RT-AC3200 router. Now this is another highly anticipated product, <laughs> but really, I mean they're all highly anticipated. This is Asus, am I right? Now, it's also the most beastly router out there. It sports six antennas and six streams. Now the AC3200 means that it allows up to a combined data rate of 3200 Mbps, split across its two wireless AC radios and one wireless N radio. Now it's easy to set up, comes with auto optimization, it'll even take all of your slower devices and put them in a different lane so it doesn't completely clog up your bandwidth. So if you live in a large family and you're a gamer, and there's a lot of people clamoring for access to the interwebs, I would say that this router is probably your best bet. Now to round out today's episode, we will be talking about the new Strix GTX 960 graphics card. Now the Strix GTX 960 is built with NVIDIA's amazing architecture from the GTX 900 series, but they've brought it down into an affordable mainstream package. Now for any gamer out there that enjoys playing their games at a full 1080p resolution, which to be honest, at this point in the game, is everyone, this card will do it for you. It packs a serious punch, allowing for solid frame rates at even the highest graphical settings. Now if you want to take it a step further and bring it up another notch, the GPU is highly overclockable, allowing for frequencies of up to 1500 MHz. One of the last things I really want to talk about the Strix card design is its amazing power delivery and cooling. Now see, the card itself will actually shut the fan off completely when it's not under load, and in fact, even still, during some light-loaded games. So if you're a gamer out there that has a roommate in college, or perhaps you're past that, you have a significant other that may or may not be sleeping 10 feet away from your computer desk, this card, you should, yeah, you should probably get this card. Well, that's all we've got for you for today. I'm Alex with Month in Review, and remember, for all things tech, check right back here at ASUS. Now, the three products we've got for you today, the first of which is the Sabertooth Night... Oh, yeah. Z97. Now it's time for it to get back to work, right? No, like that. <laughs> Let me see. We've got for you today the first of which is the. No, I blanked. <laughs>